All right, everyone. So in the last episode, I talked about the best algae eater for the aquarium. But now let's talk about the best snail killer. And surprisingly, the best snail killer is actually another species of snail. This is a assassin snail. I have three of them and they have been eating many of the other snail in my aquarium. So we can see right here the shell of one of the victim. We also have like other shell right here, right here, all over the place really. Um, there is a lot of shell. Oh, we can see our little goby right there. But yeah, these assassin snails, uh, they will hunt down the other snails and they will eat them. Now, do you really want to eliminate all your snail? Perhaps yes, perhaps no. Um, in my case, I wanted less snail in this specific aquarium because of my rooted plants. I have so many snails back in the day that they were uprooting all my plants. So I decided to not necessarily kill them all off completely, but just dwindle their uh, population. Honestly, I really enjoy snails in general. So having some snails, especially like the pond snails and their, uh, like um, the Ryan's horn snail, I think that's the name. Um, I really didn't mind those snails, but the Malaysian trumpet snail, uh, since they dig a lot in the gravel uh, and the substrate, I, I just really didn't want them. So yeah, um, there is also pea puffers that can, uh, and like other species of puffer fish that can eat certain type of snails and I've heard that loaches are also very good for killing snails but uh, trust me you 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 fight fire with fire and this fire is a snail it's a slow burn but it is a burn none of the less I just really also <laughs> enjoy watching the goby um, ever since I placed him in this aquarium, he's been super active right in the front of the aquarium, not scared of me at all. Uh, he's been a joy. In the other aquarium, I never saw him, so I'm glad uh, that he is in here now. I think it's one of the reasons why I've been filming this aquarium that much at this point. I really just enjoy the change. I will be filming the other aquariums pretty soon though, uh, just so people don't uh, get bored of this one, but I, I, I like this aquarium. Very fun, a lot of plants and cool little fish in here. Uh, we have like my uh, rainbow shark. I've had some uh, good comments about him. So his name is uh, Roos Bolton. And I have him since, I think, 2019, so what, or 2018 even, so, or even 17, huh, I'm not sure, uh, I don't remember, was it the first year of my channel, like the end of the first year that I got him, perhaps, so it, he is at least four or five year old at this point. Uh, but yeah, he's been very cool. And I also have this nice Oplo catfish. Um, that's my girlfriend's favorite fish in the aquarium. And it, perhaps even in the fish room. And yeah, I can see why. That's a pretty cool fish. If I ever see more of these guys, I will definitely get more. But uh, he's the only one I've seen in like 20 years so <laughs> yeah anyway thanks for watching and i hope you've learned something about how to murder your snails with other snails don't use chemical just use these 
It's a slow process, but it's a healthy process for the aquarium. Anyway, that's all for today. Goodbye. I said goodbye. <laughs>